What's up, you guys? Toys Craze here, doing another Beyblade video. Today's video, we have the Pink Flame Sagittario from Takara Tommy. So without further ado, let's get this thing open. So no box or anything, it only comes with a bag. And then within that bag, there are a couple other bags inside. Interesting to me how it didn't come with an actual box, but this is from Takara Tommy. I ordered this from Bays and Bricks, so uh, it didn't come with a launcher or anything. It is a genuine Takara Tommy, like I just said. It is real and i really do like the pink type of sagittario that just looks so awesome and then i also did buy uh this the launcher pack as well with the ripcord and uh it's on it's only for ten dollars on bays and bricks so if you guys do want to check it out be sure to do so but it is pretty awesome if you ask me so anyways there's really nothing else to the packaging so let's get into it and get this thing open all right, so all we have to do, take some scissors right here, cut along the sides, snip, 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 whatever, whichever side you want, and we can take each item out. So here we go, all the uh, bags inside, uh, and we also have an instruction manual right here, or a manual, and then we have another bag. So I honestly have no idea what's in each of them. I think this is probably the fusion wheel. This is probably the spin track, and this is probably the tip, but I'm not sure. So anyways, now, Let's get to it and actually cut each of these open. So first one we're going to open is this one. So let's check it out. Let's take some scissors right here. Cut it real quick. Okay, there we go. Now, can we get it? Oh, it's still, we still have to cut it. Okay, we still have to cut it more. We have to cut it. Oh, yeah, there we go. Okay. And we have the spin track. That actually kind of looks a little bit similar to, like, Beyblade Burst. It's interesting. Uh, then we have, I think, the fusion wheel right here. Let's see. Okay. Oh, wait. I think I have to cut it, like, over here. Yeah. Okay. Uh. Okay. You got it open. All right. And. Ooh. Okay. Look at that. Awesome, dude. That type of pink just looks so good. Ho oh, ho. That is amazing. And then for the final, okay, what else do we have? Oh, yeah, we have the tip right here. I think we just have to get that open. So I just rip it apart real quick. Or, okay, it's inside of another bag. This is inside of another bag in it. So I think we just have to get it. That I wonder what the spin track for the Flame Sagittario, this Flame Sagittario will be. Okay, let's see. All right. Uh, okay, I need to get this bag open. Okay. Yeah. I need to, oh, this is actually tape. They just literally just wrap tape around it. That's interesting. Okay, okay. Oh, uh, this is a little bit interesting to me. It's like a, it's like a Lindor wrapper. That's how they wrapped it, like a Lindor chocolate. Like, look at that. <laughs> oh God. Okay, maybe we should take some scissors. I don't know. Okay, I think this has probably been my me most messy opening ever. It's kind of weird why they like made like a bag instead of putting it in a box, but I don't know. These bags are like super weird. Like they're the type of bags that like are so hard to open. But, uh, anyways, uh, okay, we almost got it out, okay. Oh, I can see it, alright. Oh, god, this is, like, literally so hard to open, please, I want to see my Sagittario. Okay, uh, please, okay, did I do it? Did I finally get it? And it fell down! Let me pick that up real quick. Alright, and here we have the tip! Looking awesome, dude. And that is all the parts. Interesting. All right, let's see this. Put it together. Does this go on like that? Or Okay, yeah, clicked on. All right, and now let's get this part. Hoo -hoo. Wait, but like, what's the face bolt, though? Is this like a Beyblade Burst where you just... What? You just click together? Confused. You click the spin track together? What do you do? What? I'm confused. And there's so much dust on my hand, dude. Why are these always so dusty, dude? How do I put this in? What? I'm confused now. What do I do? What do I do here? Is there something in here, maybe? No face bolt. It's just the stickers. Uh, uh, weird. How do I put this together? Did I get scammed or something? That's weird. No, I didn't. I didn't. I don't think so. I don't think I get scammed like that, at least. 
It looks like a really nice bay. It feels good, but... Okay. Did I find... Does it have to click on or something? Oh, yeah. There it is. There it is, I think. Yeah. And that is it. That's all. Nice. Looking awesome, dude. Look at this, dude. This is looking absolutely awesome. I love that pink paint on the fusion wheel, though. That looks so good. All right, I really want to see some stickers on it. So let's get this thing open and let's go put some stickers on it. So I just got that bag open, this bag right here, and I found this uh, card right here for something for scanning. I don't know what it is. And now we have the instruction manual or the manual. And to prove its authenticity, we can see the Takarotami logo right here. So, and then we got uh, some stickers right here looking sick. I love these stickers, dude. I've always loved stickers like this. <laughs> Looks so good. And this is probably the biggest Beyblade I've ever seen, though. This is, like, huge. Like, when I first got this launcher with it, I was like, whoa, this doesn't fit any of my bays. Like, this didn't even fit Big Bang Pegasus, but that was weird. Like, I don't even know why, but looks like it's a really big bay. So, I guess now let's get the sticker on. So, let's just take it off pretty quick. All right, can we take it off? Okay. Yep. All right, we have one chance at this to make it look perfect. Let's do this. Oh... Uh, Oh, so much pressure. Come on. Does it look good? No, I think I messed up. All right, looks like I have no chance. Oh, I messed up. I think I did. It doesn't look It doesn't look proportional or proportion, proportional, whatever. Oh, God, I'm worried. I think I did it right, though, I thought, but. Oh, God, this face bowl isn't pointing in the right direction. Okay, you know what? I'll just do it the right way, okay? I'll just do it the right way, the way it's supposed to be. I think it's supposed to be like, yeah, like that. It's supposed to be like this. Wait, 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 let me do it. Oh. Uh, did I do it? Hey, there we go. I did it. Ribbit, ribbit. I did it. Nice. All right, and now this is like a, literally like a Beyblade burst. Like, that's interesting. Like, what do they do? Let's see how it does in battle, though, because that's how it's really going to prove if it's good or not, if it was actually worth it. So I feel like literally 9 out of 10 people buy it just for being able to look if it can battle well. Actually, maybe not 9 out of 10, but you guys know what I'm saying. All right, and there we go. It's fully put together. Looks awesome, dude. The stickers. The stickers always be making it look so awesome, dude. All right, and I think that's it for the unboxing and the assembly. So now it is time to go test this out in battle. And I'll say, before, before we get into that, I just love this pink. This pink looks so good. It looks like a real flame, dude. Like, it literally looks so good. And, but anyways, like I said, let's get into the battles. All right, first battle for this video will be Flame Sanitario, pink version, Tucker Tommy versus Hasbro Galaxy Pegasus. So let's get into round one. Alright, I've never seen a launcher like this, but anyways, it's pretty simple. I think it's the same way as all launchers are. Crank this up, and let's see how this, uh, Sagittario handles in battle. So on three, one, two, three! Oh, and that's shaked! That's a huge bay, dude! That's a huge bay! Oh my goodness! It's spinning real fast, dude! Ho ho! Okay! That even knocked the that even knocked the camera, dude. All right, round two. All right, round two on three, one, two, three. All right, I I launched a little bit early, but that's okay. Oh, and it only in a couple of shots too. All right, that was pretty crazy. It's still spinning so fast. It's still spinning so fast. Oh my goodness. And Galaxy Pegasus is eliminated already. All right, I guess next bay up. So if you guys have seen my previous video, Meteor El Drago was the last Beyblade I have reviewed, and it almost managed to stay undefeated. It literally beat every single bay we threw it its way, except for El Drago Destructor. So, can Sanitario stay undefeated? Or will El Drago Destructor win this battle? Alright, let's see. Alright, round one on three, one, two, three! All right, let's see. 
Oh god, Sagittarius is taking big hits! Is El Drago the signature? Oh god! I'm scared now. Come on, Sagittarius! Come on, Sagittarius! Go, Sagittarius! Go, Sagittarius! Oh! And I think Flame Sagittarius won by just a little bit. Just a little bit, Flame Sagittarius won. Like, by like a little, like a millisecond. Round one. Flames of Terrio, pink version, has taken the win. All right, round two on three, one, two, three. Oh, and it one hit. Flames of Terrio is going crazy. Oh, okay, okay, okay. This, this is getting intense. They're both losing balance, dude. Oh. Oh, and Flames of Terrio has taken round two meaning it is undefeated all right next battle will be pink flint and Aterio versus fang leon so let's get into it all right round one on three one two three go Ooh, and it's a defense versus a stamina oh all right, in round two, can Flames and Ontario stay undefeated on three? One, two, three, let it rip! Oh, oh, big hits! On three! One, two, three, let it rip! Oh, oh, big hits! From Flames and Ontario, dude. Flames of Deterio is acting like an attack type out here. Wow. Now that is insane. All right, and next battle will be Hades Kerbex versus Pink Flames of Deterio. So, let's get into it. All righty, round one on three. One, two, three. Hades Kerbex is an extremely good bay, too. Oh, and it's me. Oh my goodness. Pink Flames of Ontario has won yet again. So now it is round two. Can Flames of Ontario win this? Can Flames of Ontario stay undefeated? Every single bay that I have reviewed never has been undefeated for the entire video. So let's see on three. One, two, three. Oh. Destroyed Hades Kerbex. Hades Kerbex got destroyed. Oh, okay, that is just amazing. Okay, I I don't even know what to say. Flint of Terrio has won yet again, and now it is time to go on to our final battle. Alrighty, and now this is going to be the final battle of today's video. So now it's going to be Big Bang Pegasus. Versus Pink Flame Sagittario. So, let's get into it. So now, can Flame Sagittario stay undefeated on three? One, two, three! Oh, oh my. Oh my goodness, dude. Flame Sagittario is still undefeated. Right, and now for the moment. Is Flames of Ontario the greatest bay out of all these bays? Can it stay undefeated? On three. One, two, three. All right, we both got really good rips on that. Oh, this is going to be a close one, dude. Flames of Ontario looks like so big, though. It's like huge. Oh, Oh my goodness. Wow. By a landslide, it's still spinning. It's still spinning. It, it finally stops. So in the end, Flames of Terrio has taken down Big Bang Pegasus, Galaxy Pegasus, Hades Kerbex, 
Fang Leon and El Drago Destructor. So that is absolutely crazy as this is the first bay to ever be undefeated throughout one of my whole videos. Usually when I'm reviewing a Beyblade, it, it at least loses a, at least once. But Flint Ontario has literally stayed undefeated throughout the entire video. Congratulations to Sagittario. What an awesome run by Sagittario. And it's just so good, dude. It's so, it's interesting to me though, because like, it's like a Beyblade burst. Like you twist it and then it, it clicks on. But like I just said, Flip Sagittario is a really good bay. Especially this pink version. I really love that type of variant. The pink type of, like, it just looks really, really good. The pink just... It just looks awesome. That's all I can say. Uh, it was definitely a really, really good bay, and it was the first bay to ever win every single battle, and that is honestly pretty crazy to me. I don't know if you guys are impressed by that, but I think this is already a immediate yes. If I saw this video and I was seeing like Sagittarius just destroy, bro, I'm going and buying this immediately. <laughs> I'm just joking. But anyways, you know, it's pretty crazy to me, like, how it won every single battle. And we were both trying really hard. We were both pulling it as hard as we could. We were both pulling the launcher, the ripcord, as hard as we could. So, there was really no bad rips or anything. So, this was completely legit. So, anyways, that is absolutely crazy. But, anyways, I really hope you guys did enjoy this video. If you guys did find this review helpful, be sure to hit the subscribe button. Hit that like button and hit that notification button so you do not miss another video. But anyways, I'll see you all in the next one.